police on patrol. For the first time, Pleasant Plains has a police department. Alejandra Hernandez joins us from Pleasant Plains. And Alejandra, what brought this change to such a small town? Hey, good evening, Diana. Now, this town sits on a very busy highway. There's a lot of people that go through this town, but there's no police department. Sometimes they've had to wait up to 20 minutes. Now, the town decided that it was time for a change, so they went ahead and voted, the council voted, to bring in the police department. A small town sitting off Highway 167 in Independence County has been missing something for years, a police department. Tanya Frazier is a community member who said if people were committing a crime on your driveway, help was far away. There was nobody here and maybe they, you know, it's a long ways off, so it took a little while. And if you did, if they were there when they, which they weren't going to be there when they got back. In December, the city council voted to bring a police department to Pleasant Plains, a first for the city. On March 9th, the first police officer went on patrol. Mayor Kenneth Burns said the city depended on the Independence County Sheriff's Office for years. They also had a marshal for some time, but they also depended on themselves. Had a neighborhood watch program for several years, and after uh, COVID, it's kind of don't have as many members as we did. The city hired two full-time police officers. They've also gotten help from other surrounding departments. Batesville Police Chief has just been over backwards to help us also by donating us two cars and fully equipped, which is a lot of a lot of money and equipment. Mayor Burns said safety was his main concern in bringing a police department, but that wasn't the only thing he was looking at. We're expecting growth and whether having a police department will help bring people here also, knowing that they've got protection. For the community, seeing an officer in town for the last couple of months has already made a change. It's nice having somebody close where they care about our community because that's what they're doing. They're here to take care of us. The chief and the mayor told me that there are plans to add another police officer later in the year, but for now, they're working on adding reserve officers. Live in Pleasant Plains, Alejandra Hernandez, Kate News. Alejandra, thanks.